Hello, welcome back to 17 square meters garden. I had a few tasks to do on the balcony this week, so I thought that I will just share them with you in this sort of garden vlog. I hope that you will enjoy it and maybe even find some useful information. I'm starting off with transplanting my Coleus seedlings. I grow them from seeds every year, but this time I sow them a little bit later than usual, so they are still very small. I gently pull them apart to separate them. When I buy pansies in autumn, they are sold in these plastic pots with baskets. I keep them and reuse them for my seedlings. It never ceases to amaze me that these tiny seedlings have such a long roots already. I'm going to water and fertilize them. I will use half strength Alga Grow Fertilizer and Additive Power Roots to help them with transplant shock and to encourage healthy root growth. If you're interested in what plant care products I use and what they are meant for, I do have a separate video about that. I sowed morning glory seeds recently and originally I wanted to grow them on this ladder but this area doesn't receive any direct sunlight so I will try to grow it in the other corner of the balcony that receives some sun and I will make the plant climb on the gutter but first I have to clean it up and see if I can fit a pot in here The pot fits perfectly, so now I just have to transplant the seedlings. I reuse old soil and mix it with compost. I water them with the same fertilizers I used for Coleus seedlings. I will keep this pot here for now so that the seedlings can catch a bit more light and once they are big enough I will place them in the corner. Next is my bay leaf tree. It's one of the oldest plants that I have on my balcony. I grew it from a tiny cutting. I twisted the two trunks and I'm trying to shape it into topiary. It's tricky because it's not a very dense plant. So I prune it quite hard to encourage more bushy growth. I gather material leaves, dry them and use them in soups. A little update on my veggie pot, lettuce that I transplanted last time is growing really well, Asian greens that were sown directly too, radish is almost ready to harvest, only the seed tape was an epic fail, nothing germinated at all, so I'm sowing more radish instead. My camera stopped recording, but I covered the seeds with soil and I watered them afterwards. Alpine strawberries that I sowed last year were needing a bigger pot. I already have some on my balcony, but I wanted to add more of classic red berries and also a very unique one, yellow variety. When you transplant a plant that is root bound, it's good to tease the roots a little so that they don't strangulate the plant.
I found some ladybird larvae, they are a great natural way to control aphid invasions. Some other plants that I want to transplant are these begonias. I propagated them from my indoor plants and I really wanted to add them on my balcony because I really love their foliage. This pot is a bit large for this plant, but I'm gonna plant it on the side and tuck it under this large hydrangea. I placed the other begonia underneath my hosta. Ok, the last task for today. I decided to add ivy to this corner, at least temporarily. I always complain that it's a bit empty in here in winter, so it would be great to have another evergreen plant. Ivy is not the greatest of all plants, but it supports full shade, so I guess I will keep it here for now. So that's it for today's video, I hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again in the next one. Bye!